Okay, I'm going to be testing out a new gadget I got today. I got over the holidays, I should say. It is a Q Design um, sunglasses camera. I don't know if you'd call it a spy camera or a wearable camera. Um, this was given to me as a gift from someone, and um, trying to do some research on the company and was having a really hard time finding out any information about this company. I did know that the um, glasses were um, purchased on the Home Shopping Network or QVC or one of those things. And going to their website, they even had a different name for the, the glasses. Um, so I'm not sure if this was just something that the, the Home Shopping Network is using as the name for these or or what. I did notice um, several similar types of glasses when I was looking around on the internet and looking at videos on YouTube, but I could not find anything quite like this. Um, this is Q Video Vision, and um, here are some directions. And anyway, what it comes with is this carrying case and a pair of glasses and a clean cloth for the lenses, I'm guessing. They, they are sunglasses. It's hard to see that with, you know, the light I'm in in this room. And also a mini USB charging cable. But anyway, there's the camera. And um, if you open up the glasses, you can see that the, the ear frames are pretty thick. Um, we've got on the bottom the charger and the micro SD card is right there. It did come with one. It's a no-name kind of brand uh, micro SD card. Um, but as you'll see later in the video, it does work. And um, on the inside, we have two buttons. One is the power on and the pause button. And then one which will take snapshots of pictures. But um, what I wanted to do was to see, um, take these out into the wild, I guess, and um, compare with a um, iPhone camera, iPhone 6, and a GoPro Hero 4, just to compare the video quality and see what these do. According to the um, instructions, the camera resolution is 1440 by 1080, which I believe means uh, 1080i, and at 30 frames per second. Um, now, I know that since we're not going to, when we do the comparison, that the GoPro is going to be shooting 1080p at 60 frames per second, and the iPhone, I think, is going to be 1080p, 30 frames per second, I'm not sure. But at least it'll give you an idea of, of what the camera can do. But to start it, all you do is hold down this power button for a second or two, and then you'll see the, the solid light, which means that it's powered on, not recording. Now the light has started flashing which means that it is recording. So I'm gonna, um, we'll go ahead and take them outside and it's a cloudy day, but it'll at least give you an idea as to um, what kind of video this can produce in comparison to your phone and to a quote unquote good um, small camera, which is what we'd call the GoPro. All right, so let's go ahead and, and do some comparisons. All right, so there you have it, the Q Video Vision um, sunglasses recorder. I'm not sure what we want to call this. Um, overall thoughts, well, it works. Um, video quality is not spectacular, um, which is what you'd expect maybe from a no-name brand that um, could not find any product information about that clearly states that it was made in China for the Home Shopping Network, I guess. Um, probably too expensive for the quality that you get, but 
If you're looking for something easy to use, this definitely fills the, the void, and um, it does have, a, I guess, acceptable video quality. Not great, but um, you know, take it for what it's worth. Thank you for watching.